Hey guys, good morning. It's Layla here. Welcome, welcome. I am in my kitchen. I am uh, going to make my uh, regular smoothies. I kind of mix up my smoothies uh, on a regular basis. It's like when you get up in the morning, what is the first thing that you eat? What is the first thing that you put in your your mouth as far as um, your hydration is concerned? And as the weather is starting to change, I love smoothies and I do a variety of different ones, but I'm gonna do one for you this morning before I get out of here. Uh, I have a, a ripe, overripe banana. I'm going to start out with that because I love the flavor and I love the potassium that I get from my banana. And I take my frozen fruit. I also use fresh fruit at times, but I'm gonna use the frozen fruit because it is quick, it's cold. And um, go ahead in here, put that in here. Just wanted to share that with you. And I put some fresh strawberries in here, which are frozen. The organic brand, if you can get it, that's great. If not, um, throw a few rolls in there. And, you know, and sometimes if I have enough left over, I will put, uh, I will take some with me to, to work, whatever I have left over. So put these away. And um, I also put in, I don't know if you all have heard of sea moss. Sea moss is uh, an algae that is grown in, uh, in Africa, different parts of the world. It's a seaweed. And you cleanse it, you you know rinse it up. And what it is is sea moss has a hundred has ninety two out of 102 minerals. And uh, I heard about uh, sea moss from the well-known herbalist, uh, Dr. Sabi, and um, I make my own. So I've been making it and I have been making it, you know, with family and friends and uh, it's amazing. So I take a scoop of that. Sometimes I put more in it. Um, it is so nutritious, it's so, um, great for your health with all the other minerals that's involved in it. So I do that. I have it in the fridge ready for me to just add it in. People have been asking me, so how do you do you? How do you make your smoothie? So I'm going to make one for you. I also use spirulina. I've been knowing, reading up on spirulina since I was 16 years old. I've been using spirulina, but there are so many health benefits um, to spirulina. I mean, not only it boosts your energy, um, it has, um, it detoxifies the liver, like any metals or um, an arsenic or whatever the case is, it actually deflects that as well. Um, it also um, is, I just use just a little teaspoon. I'm gonna take some off just a little bit. It doesn't taste good. I'm gonna tell you that as well. Um, but I'm gonna share with you how I you know, make it taste decent. So I just put that in there. You know, it can lower your blood pressure, cholesterol, um, prevention of cancer, spirulina. I use this brand here. It's a now version. I usually get the big one, Earth Rise. There's different versions of it, but spirulina, life changer. And I have um, just recently started using it because I, I'm like, wait a minute. There's some things that I've been doing before that I kind of, you know, your busy life and you kind of put it to the side or you just haven't been using it. And I'm going to get back to what I have been doing because I have some goals got some things that I'm working on and um and that's the case. I also may add in um and you don't all have to do that, but you know, you do what you'd like to do. I add some ginger in it. I have some powdered uh ginger that I will just add just like a little half a teaspoon in there. And I may add some turmeric in there. We all know the benefits of that. Um, ginger and turmeric for the body, for the blood, for your arthritic needs, uh, inflammation, and so forth. So I also going to add in my sports powder, um, which is energy, put it in water, but it has its own stevia, own sweetness to it called the zing here. And I put it in the shake smoothie and, um, and that's about it. Sometimes I'll put a little bit of honey in it. Um, and, uh, or I'll add in a couple of dates 
Listen, my smoothies are no joke, y'all. <laughs> they are no joke, but I love it. So I just take, you know, two dates because they're very sweet in itself. And I add it to my smoothie, blend it up very well. Um, dates are very good for fiber. You know, we need that fiber in our bodies. And so I do that and I add my essential water, which is, you know, 9.5% um, or higher. It's ionized alkaline. And I put that in there, kind of use my judgment on, I guess, whichever thickness you like. I like mine thick, not too loose. Um, and I start the process. Put my, where's my cap? Here we go. And as you can see, the water looks like it's a dark green. All right, let's see here, guys. Let's see. like it's a you see it purple like a blueberry the blueberries very dark and you all know the darker the berry the more nutrient the sweeter the juice <laughs> there we go some of them are still chunks in it I like that too just enough so this is like a 24 ounce or so this is this, this is so good for me because it keeps me hydrated and I'm not hungry um, I have a little bit in there, a little bit left, and let's see. You don't even taste the spiraling, you taste the fruit. This is so good, guys, but I would say to you, if you're not already, start getting on a smoothie kick in the morning. It really sustains you in hydration, and my thing is, I have to drink more water, because I have been, you know, in the shop and if it's too cold, you don't want to drink cold water. Uh, but if you start out with a smoothie and then you go on with it, you've already started, you know, with your hydration because it is water. And the fruit also is, um, you know, has that hydration barrier as well. So start drinking your smoothies. I'm going to take mine along the way because I am rushing and um, drink part of it and take it with me. And uh, I'm telling you, you start getting on a smoothie kick, you start, it starts your day, you get more healthier, you start, you tend to want to eat better because you put in something great in your body. And whatever you start out with is how you continue to go. So um, start out and get your smoothie kick going and I will be sharing more content for it with you. But this is my daily routine um, and I will continue to share. I'll talk to you soon. Peace.